Guys, they said Gwenami was shocked over what uh, uh, Gisi Elder said about Oni of Ife when they came to Akure to see her family. According to what we are hearing, it's like Kabi don't enter the prepare because even uh, his people, the elders, have confirmed it because <laughs> it's obvious that Kabi needs help right now. If you remember, before Kabiesi married uh, these six wives, we heard that Kabiesi was begging Queen Naomi, and Queen Naomi said no, not until Kabiesi uh, treat uh, Ashley's fuck up, that there is no how she will return back to that palace while Ashley was there doing the calabash thing, knowing that Ashley is the main reason why the marriage did not hold. Ashley was knocking Kabiesi, because Kabiesi was knocking uh, uh, Ashley. Ashley was there pretending to be the wife because she's carrying calabash. She is eating what the wife was eating. And KBAC did not see anything wrong with it simply because Ashley came from the, the Lafogidi house, you know, and she is also from Ileife. So, Kwenomi was saying, I don't, I don't want, I don't want. It is left for KBAC to find a way to send Ashley out. Even if Ashley will be doing that job, let her... Uh, go away or kind of employ another person to be doing that job. No. Instead, the CKBC became angry. Before you know it, he went into marrying all of these women. They said he married them to prove to Kwenami that I can have as many wives as possible. If you can have as many wives as possible, why not let Kwenami go? Is marriage by force. And after marrying all of these women, KBC realizes that these people were unable to fill that gap that Naomi left there. She started going back to Naomi. Yes, she started going back to plead. And now, <laughs> KBS, who is coming out from seclusion, a lot of changes are expected from him. But, of course, he came back with changes. The changes that made him to want to fight Naomi with words in the public. The changes that make him want to uh, spite Queen Naomi at Everson. They said the elders themselves, they said they don't even understand KBC again. That ever since he came out from that seclusion, that things are no longer the same. His life has changed and is not for good. He's always angry at every given opportunity. Any little thing makes him angry. As in, this, there is no joy, no happiness. That Queen Naomi. Uh, might be thinking that KBSC is okay, that KBSC is not okay. The reason why the Gisi elders have gone to Akure is to go and beg Penaomi's family to please give them time, let them go on inquiries to find out what is exactly wrong with their son, KBSC. That the moment they are done with that, that they are going to come back to them. Coming back to them, is it the freedom that they say Penaomi was seeking? You know, uh, we heard that KBSC, that right now they are making preparations on how to go and pay bright price for another set of women. And maybe this is another episode of I am angry. I want to mar marry so many wives again because Kwenomi is saying no, no, no. As a matter of fact, Kwenomi is not even giving him opportunity to see her again. Kwenomi is always, I don't want to see you, you can go to hell, you can go and marry as, hundred, as many as hundred, it's none of my business. But there is something that someone said on my comment section, I was like, I just pray that God will fix this too. Because we all know that Tade Nikawo, if Kwenomi did not continue with this marriage with KBS, Tade Nikawo will grow in that palace with so many wives and so many children. And maybe she will be the only one without her mother then no he will not too. he will not be the only one you know i have been thinking about that thing. this is a wurola not wurola adiola adiola's mother is not in the palace does that make mean that he's she's no longer kabiesi's daughter you know i was thinking about that thing, but all of a sudden this adiola's case came into my mind and even this uh, princess adewa miwa but let's just say that those ones are ladies that they will get married and leave the palace that Adenika will be the only person without his sibling in that place or the mother being present. I don't know that in a, that, that topic, Tayami. It Tayami, but is that to say that Kwenomi is going to lay down her life because of uh, Tadenikawu? 
Anyway, she's a mother, and mothers can do anything just to for the sake of their children. I don't know. I don't know. But right now, we are hearing that Gisi elders are begging Queen Naomi's people to please give them time. That they need to start making inquiries. They need to go and find out what exactly is wrong with KBAC. That KBAC is not okay. KBAC is not okay. Could it be that because the gods are angry with him, they couldn't. Sp they did not speak with him while in seclusion that is making him this much angry? You know? Because it is obvious that this woman, he wants to gather and bring them in right now. So people are saying that he wants to do it out of anger again. Because Kenami is saying no, no, no to him. And while he's doing this, he's also threatening that he will never give Kenami her freedom. It's just, it's just that KBAC, I don't, will I say that KBAC loves Kenami, but doesn't know how to uh, maintain Kenami? Let me just put it that way. Because many people love in different ways. Hmm? Giving Kwenami gift is not how to show love. Gift is not all, love is not all about gifts. There are certain things you need to do. Women need attention more than any other thing. Women need companionship. They need affection. These are the things that Kwenami is expecting from Kabiyas, of which Kabiyas is not given. Okay, look at Toby now. They said Toby is always crying these days. Even if even when you see her uh, in an event, you will know that she's not happy. You will know that she is not happy at all. No happiness. And that is because things are no longer moving the way she expected it. Ever since she gave birth, they say KBS you know they look her way again. Sometimes if she will find her way into KBS chamber, KBS will tell her that no, I don't need you. Maybe KBS was busy uh, enjoying with all of these women that he wants to go and marry now. <laughs> KBS, KBS love women, no. He love women, no. Oh, he love better thing. Who not love better thing? But in, uh, ev uh, uh, too much of everything is very bad, though. Too much of everything is very bad. Hmm? KBAC. You should call yourself meeting, no. Call yourself meeting so that you live long because too much of everything is very bad. And I believe that it is his love for women that is causing him all of this problem and shame. Every day, KBS is in our mouth. Every day, KBS is in our mouth. Some people say, you people, you don't have another job to do. That is because KBS have given us job now. Hmm? New day, new, new story. Right now, they say KBS is not okay. Oh. His actions, not just about with Naomi, every, everything, nothing makes him happy again. Maybe when he marries this new virgins that he is planning to marry, he will be happy. <laughs> He will be happy. His happiness will come back. Let him not be after marrying all of this set again. Now we'll start hearing that she have uh, he have gone back to beg Benami again. Ah, voila. Anyway, guys, don't forget that these are all alleged information, okay? Always bear that in mind. Give this video a thumbs up. Subscribe to my channel and share my video. I love you guys. Bye. See you.